Good morning, children. In our previous class, that is on twenty sixth of August, what we have completed? We have completed the question. Change the word in color to make true sentence. That six sentences, which word was in color, we have changed to make the sentence true, isn't it? And now, see, children. Saturday, you have attended your EBS test. Still, very few students have not sent score marks. Only you have sent the question paper. So. Tell your parents to cross check and send me the scored marks. Today is the last day. Tomorrow I will not accept your marks and you will be written as that you are not appeared for the test. I will put absent for you. So today is the very last day for you to for sending the scored marks. Okay, children. Now come to unit two. My amazing body. We will start the exercise. What? Exercise E X E R C I X E exercise from page number one sixty six. On page one sixty six, they have given question and answer. So children, open your notebook, write today's date, unit, and I will write the question. You write with me, then we will read it. Okay? See children, I have written question and answer for you. What is that? What does your heart do? What does your heart do? Say, my heart, H E A R T, heart. M one my, my heart, H E A R T, heart, is like a pump. P U M P pump. So my heart is like a pump. It supplies. S U double P L I E S supplies. Pure, P U R E, pure blood, B L W O D, blood to the whole, W H O L E, whole body, P O D Y, body. So, what does your heart do? What is the function of your heart? My heart is like a pump. It supplies pure blood to the whole body. Once again, read. What does your heart do? My heart is like a pump. It supplies pure blood to the whole body. Come to question number two. What does the skull do? What is the function of the skull? C. The skull. S K U W L. Skull is a strong. S T R O N G. Strong. Bony. B O N Y. Bony. Cage. C A G E. Cage. Full stop. It protects P R O T E C T E S protects our brain B R A I N brain. So what is what does the skull do? The skull is a strong bony cage. This is a strong bony cage, and it protects our brain. Inside our skull, we have brain. So it protects our brain. Come to third question. How do your hands help you? So, how do your hands help you? Mention four things. You have to write four things about your hands. See, my hands help me to write. W R I T E. You write with your hands. Draw. You draw a drawing with your hands. D R A W. Draw. Catch things. You can hold or you can catch the things. You can catch a ball. You can catch anything. So, you catch things. C A T C H catch T H I N G S things catch things and you throw a ball T H R O W throw A B A double L ball. So what does your hand do? Mention four things. My hands help me to write, to draw, to catch things and throw a ball. So these three questions are there. Once again, shall we read? Okay. What does your heart do? My heart is like a pump. It supplies pure blood to the whole body. Second one. What does the skull do? The skull is a bony cage. The skull is a bony cage. It protects our brain. This is the second one. Come to third one. What does your hands help you? Sorry, how do your hand help you? Mention four things. Answer is my hands help me to write, draw, catch things, and throw a ball. 
Now children, pause the video. Write it very neatly in your notebook. I will rub the board and give next question answers. So first, start writing. See children, I have rubbed the board and written two more questions for you. Shall we read that? Now stop writing. Now look at the board and read with me. Fourth question is, mention all the actions your eyes can do. Now you have to mention all the actions your eyes can do. See, my eyes can be opened. I can open my eyes. Now my eyes is closed. Yes, no? Now I can open my eyes and shut. Shut means close. Now close your eyes. Shut it. Open it. See, this is the actions you can do with your eyes. I can wink. Wink means you can blink it. Just how lights blink. When the light is becoming dim, it starts blinking. So your eyes can wink. Wink means just close and open. Close and open. Close and open. Just do it fast. That is, I can wink. I can open wide open. Wide open means you have to open it wide. And show anger. When you become very angry, you open your eyes wide. Make it wide and you make the face as if you showing your anger. So these are the actions from your eyes you can do. Got it? See, mention all the actions your eyes can do. Answer. My eyes can be open. O-P-E-N-E-D. Open and shut. S-H-U-T. Shut. Full stop. I can wink. W-I-N-K. Wink. I can wink. I can wide open. Wide open means you have to do like this way. I can wide. W-I-D-E. Wide. Open, O P E N, open and show, S H O W, show, anger, A N G E R, anger. So these are the actions all your eyes can do. Read the next one. Mention all the actions your eyes can do. See, my eyes can be open and shut. I can wink, I can wide open and show anger. Come to question number fifth one. Cross out the things you should never touch. In the test book, they have given the picture of a knife, candle, a book, cactus plant, fire and a boat. So among that, which one you can't touch it? Very dangerous for you. Knife. If you touch the knife, it will cut your finger. Fire, if you will touch the fire, your hands will burn. And cactus, cactus plant is having thorns. So you cannot touch it. So these are the three things you cannot touch. Here what you have to do? Open your test book, page number 166. This question number 5, they have given the pictures there. So on the picture of knife, fire and a cactus plant, you have to put a cross mark. For these pictures, you have to put cross mark like this way. Understand? See, a cross mark like this way. You have to put it. And remaining, the things that is candle, book, then boat, you can touch the finger also. So, what is the question? Cross out the things you should never touch. Here, which things you have to put cross? I have written that one only. Knife, K-N-I-F-E, knife. Fire, F-I-R-E, fire and cactus, C-A-C-T-U-S, cactus plant. Okay, once again read. Mention all the actions your eyes can do. Answer is, my eyes can be open and shut. I can wink. I can wide open and show anger. This is your question number, question and answer of fourth. Fifth question. Cross out the things you should never touch. The answer is knife, fire and cactus. So children, note down your homework. Your homework is 
you have to write very neatly one time with neat and good handwriting write one time and by heart these question and answers and children send your work within time as you have sent your score marks within time now be updated don't remain absent day to day work you have to do reading you have to by heart the question answers you have to send the work to us okay children take care have a nice time bye